Oh, and here's your chance to be a hero. No cape required. This event to raise money for the Special Olympics in Kansas comes with a unique task. Joel Nichols is live in Shawnee with details on the challenge and how you can help our hero this morning. Good morning, Joel. We're out here in the parking lot of Splash Cove, and if you're in a place called Splash Cove, who better to talk to than Jeremiah Waters? It's all a, it's all a theme. <laughs> Jeremiah, thank you so much. He's with the uh, Marion Police Department detective there, and uh, this is this is really about heroes, heroes that are doing this good work, but also heroes that you're doing the work for. That's correct. We're doing this event for the Special Olympians of Kansas. Uh, this will be the sixth year for the Heroes Poll. Wow. Um, we've done it since 2012. It was started in about three months and planned and put together and raised about $4,000 that year. And now we're kind of shooting for about $10,000. That's right. March 12th is the date and we're going to try to get uh, as many teams signed up as possible. Kind of take me through. Look at these fine people here in the middle of the night. <laughs> uh, fire department folks, police department folks, tell me what the what the, the competition is. What do they do? So they sit here and we have these ropes hooked up to the front of a fire truck and a right. Lanco bear truck for the police department and they try to pull it for time and we combine those times and it's to win the grand champion trophy to get to take back to your police department fire department business it doesn't matter anybody can sign up for this event Man. it's a great time it's right after St. Patrick's Day Parade in Shawnee and we just love having everybody come out here and show these athletes what it means how many pounds are you pulling that truck there weighs about 21 tons so we have that one, and then the bear itself is about 32 to 34,000 pounds. Any water in the truck? <laughs> <laughs> Liar! Because <laughs> that would add quite a bit. That would be quite a so bit this of weight. Is, this is uh, an event, and you know who you're doing it for, and that must make it all the more important. It does. It, it does. The athletes call us heroes when they see us. We hand their medals out. We're heroes for them. But really, they're our heroes. They're our inspiration. When we see the day-to-day -day things that police and fire sometimes see, to go out and give a hug to an athlete and present them a, a medal means all the things in the world to us. So they're really our heroes, and this is really important to come out and raise money so that they can do the things that they enjoy. I'll make you think of this. What kind of war? mind thought <laughs> we're going to go out and pull 38,000 So several years ago myself and Virgil Henson from Shawnee went to a conference and learned about a train pole that they do up there. Oh, wow. Well that takes about 30 people and that's a lot of people to, to get together. So we thought well what can we do that's a little bit smaller? Well there's always a rivalry between police and fire. So we thought well let's put those against each other and see if we can raise enough money between the two. Um, so we scaled it down from the train to these two fire trucks and, and the Lenko Bear and the rest is history. We've just raised money year after year for Special Olympics Kansas. So in about 20 minutes, are you going to try this? Yep. Yep. <laughs> wow, there was a very lacking of enthusiasm. So right here, see this? I've always known I would reach this point. I've reached the end of my rope, right there. <laughs> but when we come back, we're going to talk more about these heroes and what they're doing for other heroes, and they're going to pull that truck. So we'll be Amazing. back in a little bit. Well, feel free to join in. Grab a rope. Extra points come for on. pulling oh. with your teeth. Yeah, I'm what they've already referred to as dead weight. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Troll. Thanks, Troll.